There we go. And this game does have a long and unnecessary, unskippable intro. So enjoy. One of the most poggers streamers. <laughs> oh, thank you, Cena. Hello. Hello. Hope you are doing well on this Friday. Uh, those are always fun. Oh, yeah. We love weird, uns unnecessarily long, unskippable intros. Uh, Cena, I am doing well. I hope you are doing well. from lack of sleep and stress so I'm in some kind of manic viral state. I've been there lately. That's been me lately. But I've been like choosing not to go to sleep when I should because I'm like, I want to be, I want to have more time awake to keep me away from work. Enjoy my free time and such. But, uh... This game. control. <laughs> Game of science. Okay. Grand Central Railway. Eight o'clock, West End Hotel, slow s slow slop? That was like slow slop. I don't know what the hell that means. Eight o'clock, West End Hotel, be there or be square. Oh. This is a flash news report. Sometime before dawn this morning, scientists at the National Observatory sighted a comet which is now fast approaching the center of the solar system. The comet passed above Pluto's orbit yesterday and is heading towards Earth. Efforts have been initiated at the observatory to determine the comet's exact orbit, and a study of possible countermeasures has been scheduled. I repeat. Okay. Comet is heading for Earth. We're all gonna die. Got it. I got my train posters all over my hotel room. Okay. Give me my suitcase. Heck yeah. Anything else I can do in here? Of course not. Look at the floor. Oop. One more. There we go. Oh, hello, sir. This room is being redecorated. I must ask you not to come in. Quite some redecorating you got going on in there. Uh, hello, child. Are we making an exchange? Are we exchanging goods? He has, I have the stuff. He must have had the money. I'm surprised that you guys have seen 
anything about this game before, if true. This game and its nightmare people. Uh, it was one of the games at the library that traumatized me. But ooh. I, this does have library game vibes to it. We have this G-Man here. What I want you to do, I explained the other day on the phone. You'll establish contact with a scientist named Horse Lover. That's a name. That's... I don't like that name. I don't like that name. Look at the photograph here on the table. Third person from the left is horse lover. Ah, we did make an exchange. Horse lovers at the museum. Go to West End Station and catch the train for East End. Get off at the Museum of Science. No need to report. I'll be in touch from time to time. Okay. I'm gonna have that tea. Oh. Gonna have that tea? Okay. Never mind. Please leave your key at the reception desk. Okay. Dude could smell the key on me. Again, look at this nightmare person. This isn't a human being. This is like a fever dream. I'll take your room key if I may. I have presumed to arrange a ticket for you. We hope you will again honor us with your stay. Want to ding the bell? All right, Grand Central Room, and we're there. We've crossfaded. Let's stop. What in the Shining? <laughs> what in the Shining? Platforms? Use the main stairway. Want to talk? To The train for East End is now boarded. Please hurry. It's like when they're standing there, stiff as a board, and just their eyes move, it's like... No. I don't like this. <laughs> this train for East End. We are about to leave. Please hurry. Again, these nightmare people. My pupils dilated and my cheek muscles twitched. Saliva flowed like it never stopped. Blood curled in my veins. Electricity shot down my spine, and when I was numb from top to toe, a purplish rash came out of my thighs and groin too. <laughs> to a metallic whine, the pain drilling through my skull, I began slowly to drift into unconsciousness. All right, <laughs> moving along. You're slightly less nightmarish. Wilhelm, Charles, George, John, Constantine, Thomas, and Mitchell. Every single one of those scientists had his head. That talk of a comet colliding with the Earth is just nonsense. Ah. This train stops at downtown Museum of Science, Grand Central, and Suburbia stations. Museum of Science, just get off at the station with that name. Okay. Ocular. What the hell? 
have I stumbled into? What fever dream am I experiencing right now? And no, I can't skip this. Enjoy the early 90s. Okay. We'll arrive at downtown. I won't be getting off here because... Oh, will I actually be getting Yes, I know Horse Lover quite well. <laughs> I'm imagining I just, like, walk up to these guys and they just talk to me unprompted. Yes, I know Horse Lover qu uh, quite well. We work together at the National Academy of Science. These days, Horse Lover and Charles are putting together exhibits for the Museum of Science. Why don't you stop at the Museum of Science? It has its own station, so you can get off there. That's what I'm trying to do, but the game is like, nah, you gotta stop here. Ah! The train is about to leave. Please hurry. Sorry, the game wanted me to talk to that dude. I'm not gonna get over... Yeah, none of us are gonna get over horse level. Almost sounds like a really bad James Bond character. Horse lover. Charles is horse lover's right hand man. He's over at the Museum of Science. He's been collecting parts, just junk really. He puts them together and makes these strange machines for display at the museum. What they've got in mind is hard to guess. Okay. I'm looking for a man who escaped from the hospital. He's got a handlebar mustache and beady eyes. Seen anybody answering that description? No danger of him hurting anybody, but he's an, he's an out and out pervert. Uh, can't have him running around free as a breeze. Be free as the breeze. I think the coffee was drugged. Next thing I knew, I was tied up in a chair. This tall guy starts talking to me and he's laughing at me. Laughing at the time, I don't remember much after that. The sound of a machine starting up rang through the room. A lot of whirring, whirling lights came together. And shafts of light stabbed into my optic nerves. The things that are told to me unprompted. I just like look at the dude and he's like, I was drugged. Mm, yes, indeed. The loud screaming TV. And no, I can't out this. I was just like, oh, maybe there will be something different. No. Same shit. A loud screaming TV demands our attention. at the Museum of Science in a few minutes. Dude just snuck up behind me with his nightmare face. Alright. Guessing it's 
that way. Hello, demon person. Please wait for the next train bound for East End. If you see my signs, check the monitor at the foot of the stairs. This guy, what do you want? I'm a police detective. I'd like to ask for your cooperation. We're looking for a man named Horsley. A megalomaniac and a pathological liar. I think he's the leader of a revolution. The white-haired guy who's been agitating... Uh, yeah, agitating among the scientists. If you see him, get in touch with him. I feel like talking to demon people. Ah. Horse Lover insists that the Earth will be destroyed in a collision with a comet. Nobody believes a word of it. At the museum, at the water tower, at the observatory, scientists are performing bizarre experiments. They've all been brainwashed by him. They're just tools in Horse Lover's hands. Don't, don't say that sentence to me ever again. Sorry, I just was trying to get out of the station. It only, it'll only let me talk to him. Slow slop here. The situation's changed. I have something else I want you to do for me. Horse lover's got six people under him. You've got the photographs I gave you of those scientists, right? I want you to keep them under surveillance. Give me reports on what they're researching, and why. I'll get in touch with you again, later. How, um, how do I leave? Actually, I'm not falling for that trap. I don't want to listen to someone talk about weird things. Did I have to say anything else to this guy? Going to the Museum of Science. Oh, I had to talk to him again. Okay. Going to the Museum of Science, aren't you? Horse Lover and Charles are monomaniacs. They're using scrap metal to make weird machines. And then he vanishes. Ah. Please watch this cult video. Provocative.
cool. for an old guy that loves horses. Dentist chairs and vacuums. Hooray. This museum has it all. Child. It's the child who exchanged the goods with us. Break. Child. Bring me the child. My best Werner Herzog impression. You just heard it. Please clap. <laughs> ah, it's an old dude now. You either get child or you get old dude. There is no in between. So I Oh no, it won't let me escape. Now we've gone to the museum viewing room and looked at child and old man. What do we got in here? Ah! You there. The old man. Have you taken a close look at the exhibits? They're all old-fashioned machines. We've fixed we fix them up so they work. For example, this apparatus here is called a sensorama. It was developed to make prisoners of war tell all. We've reworked it so that we can use it as a machine that draws out latent powers. Why don't you start around? took the bad acid. <laughs> Yoink! I'll just take this and throw it in my suitcase. You won't be needing this. When we get this sensorama finished, we can store the memories of chosen people as data. Together with Horse Lava, we've done a series of experiments. Horse Lava should be in East End. I'll get in touch with him a if you're in a hurry, use the light plane on the second floor. And he vanishes. N running up to the second floor in a feverish state. <sighs> Need to get to the light plane. In a hurry. <sighs> 
Hmm, yes, I'm pretty sure this will work. No, oh, you're flooding it! Ease off the gas, you're flooding it. So many uh, valves and gears in this. One little weird plane. What am I taking out here? Binoculars! This game's all about percussion. Ah! And this one four second loop is all we get. We're bound for East End. For East End. Will you come aboard? I guess? What even am I doing at this point? I'd like you to get the details from most. Our plans have entered the final stage. Who our orders come from, I don't know. And I'm afraid I don't know the reason behind all of this. Be that as it may, we need your cooperation. The water tower where Horse Lover has his laboratory? Go right through East End Station. Get on the monorail. Regularly a regular schedule of non-stop trains. Yay! We arrive at Grand Central. I like how everyone just happens to have info on this one dude that we're looking for. Ah! The train will remain here for a few minutes to adjust to schedule. Okay. Feverishly running around the train station. Okay. Ah, you there. 
Horse Lover has six associates. I'm one of them. Some people think we're crazy, but first listen to what I have to say. Since he learned about the existence of Comet, uh, Horse Lover's done all he could to warn people. Not only does nobody believe him, there's even an effort afoot to have him executed on a charge of inciting to riot. Uh, Comet is closing in, the apocalypse draws near, you've simply got to cooperate with us. Is that it? Is that all I, is that all I get? Well, I guess lucky me that I'm here to talk to these weirdos. Please hurry, the train is about to leave. Ah! This train will not stop at the National Observatory. Next stop is Suburbia. You can verify the train's present position by checking the route map in the vestibule between cars. Okay. This is the fancy car. Ah, you there. I'm a Federation cop. Have you seen Horse Lover? If you know anything at all, tell me. It won't do you any good to hide what you know. Things will go easier on if you spill. Okay. I'll tell you about it. Ah, you there. Ah, it's this creep. You seem to be still in one piece. How did you like the museum? Did you get an eye full of the exhibits? All they've made are gadgets that look like scrap heaps. If they want to leave Earth, they should build a spaceship. No matter how you look at it, it's just not right. You'd be wise to keep them at arm's length. Ah! This train doesn't stop at the National Observatory. If you want to go to the National Observatory, catch the train at East End heading back to West End. Okay. Six second loop, six seven second loop. The comet is closing in. You've got to believe us. Horse lovers waiting at the water tower. Change onto the monorail at East End. Did you see the Sensorama at the museum? Horse Lover uses that machine to control the scientists. Those scientists who've had their Sensorama baptism, they are true believers in the approach of the comet. I'll say it one more time. You better talk. I'm a Global Federation police officer. I also have authority as an intelligence operative. Uh, I'm with the secret investigative agency, Grand Central Troublemakers. Gets, oh, Grand Central Troublemakers gets sent to 306. Isn't that where we came from? Are we a Grand Central Troublemaker? Ah! Thank you for riding Grand Central. Shuttle service on this rail line connects West End to East End. Or West End and East End. Pulling into suburbia now. East End is next. Last stop on the line. Okay. Oh.
I don't know what I've gotten myself into. situation's worse. You've got to hurry. Establish contact with horse lover. Find out, uh, find out for me everything you can. If that horse lover says, if what that horse, if what horse lover says is true, I can't fucking read. If what horse lover says is true, we haven't much time left. But enough time for me to feverishly run back to the train. This really is like a fever dream. Back to the drum loop. Ah! Okay. Ah! Last stop on the line. We'll arrive at East End in a few minutes. Okay. You didn't have any other weird people for me to talk to? May I see your ticket, please? Thank you for traveling with us. Ah! Have you seen a man with a handlebar mustache? I'm a doctor. I've come to take the patient back. Be careful, man. He's a genuine pervert. Stretch him out on a revolving torture rack, and the man's all smiles. He's that kind of person. Okay, well, he's into S&M. Whatever, man. See this dude over here. Ah! <laughs> Horse lover set up his equipment in the water tower. He's performing his experiments in there. Uh, if you want to go see Horse Lover, take the monorail. Go straight ahead, and you'll see a stairway on the left. You can get to the monorail that way. All right. Well, thank you. Ah! That's a horrifying. This headache won't leave me alone. The pain is like being caught in a tight vice. Every time the whistle sounds, a grating noise creeps from deep in my ears up the back of my skull. I need a corset made of iron to support my head. A thick steel collar that'll stand up to superheated steam. Alright, dude. the monorail? Go around by that stairway to the left. To the left? All your shit in a box to the left. Okay, can I not, like... Um... Go straight ahead and you'll see Can I... Can I... 
Can I, can I go? You're in my way. I don't even know where I am half the time now. Ah! Hold on. Go back. There's a new person. The conductors, the ticket punchers, the scientists. Every one of, every one of them here is crazy. But you're not, and that's why I can talk to you like this. The normal ones are you and me. Just the two of us. Just the two of us. We can make it if we try. Just the two of us. Just the two of us. I think this is where the monorail is, which is, dude, they did, were not telling me the right directions. Click around a bunch and you'll find it. Ah. The monorail is easy enough to run. Just turn the lever on the operating panel. Okay. There we go. It is happy hour. What's everyone drinking? What is everyone drinking? I mixed some dragon fruit Red Bull and Mezcal, and it's delightful. Uppers with my downers. Water. Fair enough. Gotta stay hydrated, you know? You had a cookie? Cookies are delicious. I've been trying to cut down on sweets and all that so that I can, like, lose weight and shit. I am down... 16 pounds, I think? I think I'm down 16 pounds, so that's good. Oh, you don't normally eat sweets. Gotcha. Yeah, I'm very happy, but it's been, like, a lot of plateauing and... Just, like, damn it, body. Thank you, though. Thank you. It's been a very difficult process. Ah, it's right here. Open for me. Open. Ah, there we go. Yeah, the plateaus are so terrible. There was a long time, there was like a long stretch where I was stuck between like 233, 234, and now, like, as of this morning, I'm down to like 228, so I'm like, hell yeah. touch that until I talk to this dude. This is Host Lover's Observer. <laughs> this is Host Lover's Laboratory. Host Lover's building a small spaceship called the Ark. He's doing it to save the human race. At this laboratory, we're refining fuel ore for the ship. We aim a laser beam at a piece of, medi at a, piece of a meteor to determine the mineral contents utility of this fuel. Tell me more about that poop. About three months ago, a meteor fell near here. Some meteors have this unique chemical constituent due to its composition. It reacts to a laser beam. 
Refined meteorite stored in a capsule can be used as a semi-permanent fuel source. Pull the lever to the left and remove the laser trigger mechanism. Horse lover is waiting at the laboratory. Give the laser to him. Like how I said laboratory earlier. Just like, nah, it's laboratory. Laser in my suitcase. Wow, that's a big ass laser. <laughs> Alright. Where's the dude? He has escaped! Slow slop here. Horse lovers heading for the observatory. Get back to East End as quick as you can, and catch the next train bound for West End. Get off at the National Observatory. I'll contact you there. Okay. Bo! Oh, what? Ah! If you meet a man with a handlebar mustache, contact me. Okay. I'll chase that man to the ends of the earth. I'll never, ever give up. Okay, well, like... What the fuck, dude? The train for West End is boarding now. It's almost departure time. Oh, okay. train is bound for Wesson. Please note that we will not stop at either suburbia or downtown. Cool. Oh, wait. Hold on. I probably need to go back. Hold on. Oh, okay. I go... No, okay. Maybe I go... Aha! There it is. What the fuck is this loop? Okay, there's changing notes, okay. Sampled a small section and then just changing the pitch. Got it. It doesn't excuse the fact that it's so random, though. You there. Ominous clouds gathered in the western sky from the east. Uh, from the east came a... There's no punctuation, so I never know how I'm supposed to, like, read this. Uh, from the east came a gentle wind to lick the earth. On the seventh day rose a flood. For forty days and nights the rain fell on the earth. I see everlasting darkness. Okay. You know about Sensorama? That machine insinuates itself into your mind. It draws a strange power out. I don't really know how to describe it. It's an extremely mystical experience. Okay. You there. Ah, I think this is the dude. Look at that handlebar-ass mustache. A doctor is looking for me? I escaped from an insane asylum. Right, escaped from an insane asylum? 
This is all a terrible mistake. The crazy one is him. He's been chasing me ever since we were in officer's training school. You'd be wise not to have anything to do with him. Ah! Did you talk with Horse Lover? This train stops at the National Observatory. You want to get off there. It doesn't stop at Suburbia. The National Observatory is next. We're gonna dissolve there! I'm out of beverage. Ah! That man is in need of dire punishment. We'll hook him up to the sensor amp. Oh, what? Back in those days, the machine was in the charity hospital. It looked like some sort of revolving instrument of torture. Just to think of it brings a smile to my lips. That man in a straight jacket, his face twisted in pain. Uh, I gotta go now, buddy. Oh, no, get away. Uh... Planning the construction of a small-scale spaceship called the Ark. I am Thomas, the chief designer. Horse Lover is an incredibly capable scientist. You won't go. You won't go wrong to trust his judgment. The comet's approaching. Go see Horse Lover in the observatory. Okay. Um. Binoculars. This is horrifying. Okay. And he's vanished. Ah! This car is all private compartments. What, am I not good enough for your... I'm going there. Okay, I guess not. Are you looking for horse level? Get off the National Observatory. You'll find him there. The train will remain here for a few minutes to adjust to schedule. Okay. Hello, have we here? Ah. Insert the battery in the machine. Uh, it's this one. Yeah. Everything's going disco. Lone chair in there. I don't like that. George contacted me about you. I'm Horse Lover. There he is! We finally met Horse Lover, everyone! I'm Horse Lover. First, I want you to see the comet with your own eyes. Put the laser. 
It's to calculate the local distance. The, oh, focal, sorry. It's to calculate the focal distance of the comma. My left? What are you talking about? What? That was to my right! This game is not good with directions. People do not tell me the right place. denies the reality of the comet. He's taking measures against us. <clears throat> but the army chief of staff, slow slop, he's in agreement with our position. Orlovsky doesn't know it, but slow slop is here, uh, is helping us. Because of his position, he can't act openly. That's why I've called on you. Calculations are completed. Look into the exit of the comet. I got it. Please gaze upon the cinematic. Ah, he's gone. Ah, there he is. The comet is approaching. We are going to get aboard the spaceship Ark and make our escape from Earth. A sign from Slow Slop, and we begin construction of the Ark. That sign is you. The Nova Express is about to leave from the underground station. I want you to get on it. The plot thickens, question mark? <laughs> okay. It's the boy! Yes. At least the game's just kind of like, yeah, you're not going to backtrack. Like, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> Look, you know where to go. You know what's happening. Like, we're just going to cinematic your way onto that train. You're going to watch a boy melt. It's fine. It's you again. Did you hear what Horse Lover had to say? We've been manufacturing parts for the Ark. Uh, Museum of Science. Completed parts are carried on the Nova Express to a military installation. Nova Express is a special train that leaves from West End. Uh huh. Wait, 
We're now arriving at Grand Central. Ah! <laughs> they say that because of the meteor shower, the inbound trains have been halted. Who knows how close to West End this train can go? At Grand Central, passengers aren't being allowed into the platform area. Okay. Oh, he's like blinking. I was like, is, what is that glitching? I'm gonna say this guy. I don't even know at this point. I don't even know what the fuck is going on. <laughs> only two movies in this one and we were we're back to watching the child no clip through the door Charles has been regularly transporting exhibits out of the museum. He should be in the baggage car. an exhibit uh, from the Museum of Science. The arts engine has been built into it. It's the last part, and now my job is done. The train's about to leave, so you better slip back to your car. Don't let any of the other passengers see it. I don't know, with my feverish running, I, it, that's going to be difficult for people to miss me. This train is bound for West End. It will not stop at either the Museum of Science or downtown. Okay, good. Wait, hold on. Nope. Nope. Okay, there's a bunch of failed stuff. I don't. Okay. All right, creepy dude. Get aboard the Nova Express. I will be waiting in the control room of the Omnibus. These loops are... These loops are something. I don't think it's anything good, but, you know... Ah! A 
grimy black dog wandered into a certain village. It was hungry and went around scratching at villagers' doors. Some scared it away with guns. Some talked it away. There came along a man with a sweet smile. The black dog followed, wagging its tail. Uh, the next day, the black dog's meat was laid out at, a, at the butcher's. Now, who do you suppose that black dog is? What the fuck? I'm sorry, what... What the fuck was that? Slow Slop and Orlovsky, Horse Lover, uh, Slow Slop and Orlovsky, Horse Lover and the Six Scientists, the Hotel Porter, the Station Employees, the Conductor, and the Twelve Passengers. Either you believe them or you don't. The boy comes from the beyond, pulling a big boat. Uh, pulling a big boat, he floats down gently from the sky. What David Lynch nightmare did I stumble upon here? I just like doing hallucinogens when I engage the trip machine. Not the nightmare people. This train is bound for West End. It won't stop at the downtown. All our preparations have been complete. I can't find the scanner. Uh, I can't find the scanner that's got the blueprint. Get that scanner for me, will you? We have no time to spare. The comet is almost too late. Apparently, Neubauten is on the train. The train stopped. There's been an accident on the line. Hold on, let me feverishly run up there. Excuse me, I'm lucid dreaming. Does anyone need any help? Why does this dude get off the train? Who even are you? What are your credentials? What makes you think getting off the train is a good idea? It's dangerous. Please return to your car. We don't know when repairs will be completed. We'll have to go back to downtown. It, oh, okay. what's happening <laughs> or like I know what's happening but like what the fuck <laughs> let me tell you one more time about that machine when you hear it go into operation circles of soft light expand before your eyes then shooting out blinding rays like the sun's corona 
The circles of light sink from the forehead to the throat. The circles of light now change into perfect glows, shedding a pearlescent gleam. They break apart and scatter. With his silver suitcase in hand, the boy flew off to a world beyond. He waits atop the holy mountain at the tower. Uh, waits atop the holy mountain. At the tower, he waits for the ark to come. Okay, cool. You find horse lovers' men, report to me. It's not too late. I'll hand them over to Orlovsky. I'll have him execute uh, I'll have him execute them in the coolest way. So you are a freak. Uh, we shall make an unscheduled stop at downtown. God, these fucking cuts. I'm getting so sick of these cuts. In this. At this stage, we have no idea when operations will resume. Ask for details at the station office, please. Horse lover's gone ahead to West End. We'll have to hurry. Give those levers on your left there a pole. The ones against the wall. We'll take the old line to West End. Okay. Who are you people? Who are these people? Everyone's just like... Everyone knows everything that I'm looking for, and people are just, like, randomly helping me get to places that I need to go. Like. From this point, the train will be running at reduced speed. We ask for your patience. Ah! We've entered the final stage of our plans. We'll each take some of the parts and put them together at the army base. The Nova Express will be coming into the underground platform. You don't need a ticket. Hurry, you mustn't miss it. Okay. We will arrive at West End shortly. Ba -da 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 -da. Thank you for riding the uh, for riding Grand Central. I'll take your ticket. A wagon pulled by a black horse appeared before the seven horses of seven colors frolicking in the meadow. Two men were aboard, one tall, one short. The tall one called to the seven horses, Help pull the wagon. Eight horses wait what? Eight horses now. Eight horses pulling the wagon with two men aboard headed off uh, for the summit of the mountain. The short man remained silent. Very... Whatever. Let me finish telling you about the Sensorama. God, fuck. <laughs> the fine dust of, sh uh, of the shattered globes glitters as it sifts down to the floor. The golden motes spread across the floor, and for yet a while their brilliance remains undimmed. Among those who share this mystical experience, I know 12. Okay. Get the fuck out of my way so I can... <laughs> Look, I gotta, like, go meet a dude about a thing and... The Nova Express is coming to the underground platform. Passengers are probably getting aboard now. Hold on. Wait, what, where am I going? What the fuck is happening?
So I ran around like a lunatic. Oh, Nova Express is about to leave. Please get on board. Department 12 has been reserved in your name. Package has been left here for you. Uh, this is 10, but okay. This is a flash news report. Before dawn this morning, it was verified at the National Observatory that a comet is approaching dangerously close to Earth. According to the observatory's announcement, the approach of the comet will disturb the Earth's magnetic field, giving rise to a range of natural disasters, from earthquakes to floods and tidal waves. I repeat. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, present. What is this? I don't know, but it goes in there. <laughs> Rama binoculars, uh, electric generator, electric generator, uh, helium neon laser, scanner, radio. Okay. Apparently, someone just like left my notebook there. Ah, the child is huge now. Oh, wait, yeah, what? Slowslop has given us his permission to use the military installation. All the materials we need are there. With our gadgets, we can complete the arc. Or Slover told me, they're in your suitcase. Okay. Ah! Uh, was the scanner in compartment 12? There's no problem as long as we get it back. Give it to Horse. There's no time to build a large ship. We've decided uh, on a small-scale spacecraft. We can't all fit aboard, and we haven't yet decided on a destination. Nobody knows how far the ship might have to go. The Ark will keep on traveling as long as the fuel ores last. I believe in horse lover. There you go. That's the quote of the game right there. Uh, since our days... Uh, at the National Academy of Science, he's directed our activities with impeccable judgment. The escape plan using the Ark? The escape plan using the Ark. It was Horace Lover who developed it. He's a man who can save the world. I, for one, believe it to be so. Okay. We've transported the military installation, all the machinery we manufactured at the museum. Thomas has the, bl the blueprint for the Ark, and Wilhelm's prepared the fuel ore. Once we've completed the first craft, we'll shift immediately to mass production. We need your cooperation. Time is of the essence. The end is near. Okay. Go to the compartments of each of the scientists and hear what they have to say. That's a message from Morse. That's what I... That, but that's what I did. That, that's what I just did. Did I miss one? Or? Uh, permission to use... Uh, yeah. Oh, I don't think I talked to this dude. Uh, have you gotten the scanner? Get it out of your suitcase. I want to check the state. Uh, you can start it up just by turning the switch. Okay.
that neatly in my suitcase. Parts of the data have been altered. Check once more at the control room. Nova Express will arrive soon at the Army base. Go to the locomotive cab and get the fuel ore from Wilhelm. This game is something else, man. Ah! <laughs> I heard about it from Horselum. The fuel ore is clipped on the wall there. What are you talking about? What do you mean clipped on the wall? Oh, there it is. Oop. I don't know, man. Where the fuck's it go? Ah, it goes over there. Okay. I wanted to stop at 6.30 and make it a shorter stream than usual, but I'm like, we're almost there, so maybe I'll keep going? I'm also just very confused and bewildered by what I'm experiencing right now. Nova Express is going to pull into the roadhouse. Okay. Control rooms off the mezzanine. Hurry up. Okay, cool. That's a train. Uh. Alright, let, uh, let's get the gadgets in and finish up the arc. You get up on up to the control room. But cinematic up there. They got an air hockey table. Wilhelm, George, and Charles. The three of them are waiting for you in the control room. I almost feel like the designers were just kind of, at this point, just like, whatever, will cinematic him there. Which, like, I kind of get it, but at the same time, like, come on. Let me experience this. Ah, all the old dudes. And the scanner to Wilhelm. Thank you, Wilhelm. We'll send the blueprint data from here. Insert the scanner in the input. Lamb. It do get warbly. It's like a snowmobile.
and the laser to George. Which one of you is George again? You? And the laser to George. Okay. This. Hold on. You there. I'm going to attach the laser. Insert the laser into the mechanism. Why do I have to do everything for you people? Laser. Cool. Pass the battery to Charles. Charles. That's. I don't know why I was thinking he was. Uh, insert the battery. Yeah, because again, I have to do everything for you people. Alright. Boop. Put the battery up in that bad boy. Ah, there we go. Horse lover's waiting for you in the front of the ark. Okay. That's over here. The ark is ready. The data in the scanner was added by Slow Slop. The Ark will adapt to all conditions. Slow Slop's design is immaculate. The route to your destination has been inputted. Insert the ore uh, in the instrument panel. You can rely on the direction finder there at the upper right to guide you. Slow Slop has designated you. We won't be far behind. See you soon. Am I going to die? Go! blinking and I don't know what's happening. Ah, there we go. Time to become Optimus Train.
feel like this is going to be a maze section, and uh, it's going to suck. Target. Shoot him down. Press, press the button. Ah, there we go. Okay. All the cinematic bits that they've made, they couldn't have just made this a little cinematic bit instead of what it is now. Oh, I have control. I didn't even notice that. Do a barrel roll. The game is really burning me out. I'm sure for the time this was really impressive, but... And, like, I kind of get it, but at the same time, like... Like, you need some music or something going on then. Music that isn't like four second loops. Well, 
also curious what era this game takes place in, because there's a lot of it that's very, like, kind of 40s, sort of, but then it's like you got this stuff that's very, like, maybe, I don't know. I'm curious. I didn't see any dates on Mule shoot case. I was the one who switched suitcases on you. We needed someone to work with us. Mass produce the Ark and head for this tower. Comet is approaching. And we're all gonna die. Destruction of the Earth is a certainty. Actually, I don't know who the fuck is talking. Uh, the mother ship is now in position. What? The mother ship will set off for our planet. Were they aliens the whole time? Ah, he is the boy. Wait, maybe, I guess? What is happening? We have to take drugs again. Get get enveloped by the world of disco. This is the fourteenth subject. We finally succeeded. Brainwaves are normal. No danger of after effects. I mean after effects is the subject will help make more art. Everything we everything went according to plan. We have absolute memory control. The sensorama is ready. No one can deny you know, Lord Orlovsky. Um, of course, of course, of course.
Hooray, we finished the game. Koji Ueno, he didn't compose shit. He composed like four second loops. And I guess this bit, but like... Human graphics. <laughs> the human graphics. These graphics are very human. So there is a sequel to this game called, uh, or I say sequel, I don't know if it's actually a sequel or if it's just something that takes place in the same universe. Huh, Toshiba EMI Limited, of course. Um, it's called Gadget Past is Future. Uh, I don't think I'll play it soon, but, you know, eventually. Um, but, uh... 